I was an intelligence analyst. I was in the Second Infantry Division for a year at Camp Casey, which is right on the DMZ. Um, and I was then at Fort Bragg in a special operations unit and did intelligence for them for six months out of the, a task force. Well, I grew up in Florence. I went to West Florence High School, graduated in 2010. And uh, I joined the Army after high school, after failing out of tech for the first time for criminal justice. Uh, was active duty Army for four years. And uh, now I find myself back at tech, really enjoying the machine tool program. I wanted to use my GI Bill um, to get a good job to learn how to make things by hand, starting with raw material and making a piece that is precise down to one third of a human hair its thickness um, was really appealing. My favorite part about the program that I'm in is I get to use my hands, not just my brain. Um, that's where I can really shine because I have a lot of attention to detail and like to make it as best I can. The most challenging thing about the program is Memorizing all the codes for the CNC machines. Um, golly, it's all, it's all just really hard. <laughs> the machines are M code, they're CNC lathes and CNC milling machines. You use the milling machines for square stock and then you turn down bars on a lathe and profile and contour it to how you like it. It's extremely difficult in the beginning, but just to keep your head down. Um, we started with about 30 students. We're now down to six or seven and as long as you listen to the instructors and show up willing to work, you will be one of the few that gets through. I was never a student, um, never really cared about education during high school at all. Now that I'm here, I honestly do care because of everything riding on it. Um, my ultimate goal is to be financially stable with my wife, being able to contribute and take the load off of her. And I have a sense of pride because I've accomplished something that I thought that I wouldn't have been interested in, but it really captivated me and pulled me in. I hope to get on full time at Nucor, currently where I have my internship. It was kind of an end state into why I chose what I chose the program because there's an internship for machine tool students. Um, worked really hard, and um, I'm really looking to get on full-time there. At Nucor, I do a lot. They have a, I'm in the quality control. There's a tensile pulling room where you break steel and test the tensile strength so you know it's within spec. There's uh, a metrology lab where you're under a microscope looking at grain structure and inclusion ratings. I run a CNC lathe there to turn down bars for testing. So everything that I learned here about that really helps with the programming and getting the bar right for them to test. Also we're running around the mill learning about steel making and then metallurgy is also a part of that. So it's really just, they got me everywhere. Really the, the education helped me out there learning about the mechanical properties of steel, the differences, um, and really ap applying it at work. I haven't had to do almost any homework on knowing what I'm looking for or what needs to be done next because I already learned 95% of what I needed to know in the machine tool program. If somebody thinks that they might be interested in it, I would challenge them to come down and talk to the instructors because I thoroughly enjoyed both of my instructors for Machine Tool and I know that they would do anything to help us out. And I can't thank the foundation enough for allowing and Nucor allowing me to be a part of it.